What's up guys, it's Jacob back with a brand new video on the channel and in today's video this is the last episode or video or uh, something like that in my mental health series kind of series. Um, so I really, I wanted to end this series the right way, I wanted to end it with overthinking. Everyone deals with overthinking, as especially me, sadly, um, probably the worst out of a lot of people. Um, anything can trigger it for me um, if someone doesn't respond fast to me, if it takes someone a long time to respond fast to me, um, you know, if someone doesn't want to hang out, if someone, um, you know, isn't feeling in the best mood, it can also trigger it too. So it's been kind of difficult for me to handle it based off of other people, if they're, you know, um, if they're actually, you, you know, busy and stuff like that, which is like the pro this is the real reason, and then I just started overthinking everything. But in today's video, I wanted to give you guys some tips that I'm probably going to have to follow, um, definitely. And I know a lot of you guys will have to too, because I've been hearing a lot of people do overthink. So it makes me feel a little bit better knowing I'm not the only one. Also, check out the shirt. It, dude, it is. I, I love this shirt. I, I, I'm really starting to like these these type of style of shirts. Since summer's coming up, um, I'm going to be getting a lot more of these shirts. And you're going to be actually seeing a lot of these in Season 2 of The Adventures of Lobo next year. Um, so let's just keep your eye out. Keep your eye out for these type of shirts. Anyway, overthinking is dangerous. It is very dangerous. It can ruin friendships. It can ruin relationships. It can ruin any. It can ruin a lot of things for you. To be completely honest, it can ruin your 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 motivation, your energy. It can mo It can ruin your mind. It can ruin you, your mood, um, a lot of stuff. So I say the first tip, the the first thing that I've been trying to do is to it's just, it's just being self-aware that i'm overthinking and um you know i've been overthinking a lot with friends and stuff like that so when they're busy and all that type of stuff i've been telling myself you know like i'm aware that i'm overthinking at this time so i'm just telling, i'm just saying hey i'm overthinking like none of this stuff that i'm thinking in my head is, is going to happen i'm not going to lose them they're, they're not going to forget about me right um so I say the first thing is just being self-aware, and I, the it also goes into the second thing. The second thing I would say is, um, um, it is to talk to yourself in a calm way. You know, basically what I just did is it's just just tell yourself good things and say like, this is not gonna happen. You're overthinking. Um, it's gonna be okay. You know, give it time. You know, give yourself some time. Um, so that's the second thing. Talk to yourself in a calm way. Which is also a great thing because it leads it, it leads from the first thing being self aware of it leads straight into, straight um, into the second topic or the, the second tip um, is talking to yourself. The third thing, the very important third thing, get off of social media, get off of it for the day, not for a few hours. Go outside, do something outside. You know, do something that's not on your phone um, because when you're overthinking. You tend to be on social media, be on the internet a lot, and that can also ruin it. Um, you know, go on a walk, get your mind off of things. Um, you know, watch a funny movie, watch something that's going to distract your mind and will stop you from overthinking. What I used to do is actually watch funny movies a lot. Um, I, I still do sometimes, but not not as rarely as I used to. So I say that's the third thing: thing be off of social media, give yourself some space. Do stuff that you enjoy doing that will distract your mind from overthinking and it will go away. Um, I did I did really well from overthinking. I say when therapy, I started therapy, I went a few, I say I went five or six months or so without overthinking, which is absolutely amazing. I did not think I would um, get through it, but I did. Um, you know, but then it came back, and and, and and sometimes it still lingers. I was I was literally just overthinking like 10, 15 minutes ago before I filmed this video, which is actually the funny thing. So I was like, you know, I gotta get this video out tomorrow. Um, I gotta get it filmed. So that is the what was it? What the the, the third tip is to uh, you know get your mind off of things, distract yourself. Um, I'm gonna I'm trying to think of a fourth tip. To give you guys, I'm trying to think of one, but I can't really think of anything right now. Um, but those are the three main tips that I give you guys. I also did post an overthinking thing on my Facebook page, um, you know. So if you guys 
do you want to see it um it will be on my facebook i don't know if i'm gonna put it in the description or not but it, it gives you some pretty good tips too i'll also share it probably here on this side or on the other side if i have time um but thank you guys so much for this series guys i have really enjoyed filming these mental health videos for you guys um maybe in the future i'll film other videos other different topics if you guys would like um but until then you thank you guys so much for the series we have more series we have more stuff coming to the channel this year guys we have two very huge projects coming in july we have a film coming out in october and then we have another film coming out in december so there's still a lot to be here on my channel guys um a lot to come in the next couple weeks the next couple months thank you guys so much for watching my channel guys we're at 340 subscribers if we can get to 400 subscribers before june 2nd that'll be absolutely crazy incredible uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.